Hey guys, how's it going? This is Board Game Bros, and uh, today we are going to be playing through Mercado de, de Lisboa, the solo campaign. And so we're actually going to play the first mission. So if we go ahead and take a look, take a little peek. Let's get a closer look. Okay, so we're going to set up just like normal, just like for a multiplayer game. Um, and so the challenge is uh, the specialist. So we are to score one, two, or three fame points for earning 80, 90, or 100 coins. And this challenge is this. In this challenge, you are only allowed to earn money from a single type of stand. You may open stands of other types, but never collect money from them. There are no special setup rules for this game. You still earn, earn one coin for each restaurant that you open, regardless of its type. Okay, so let's go ahead and go back to the main screen. And so let's get started, guys. Um, and so what we have here, and actually, uh, you can't see my options. But these are my current options. So right now I have two flower stand, two flower stands and one chicken stand. Um, and on this side, we have two grape stands and one chicken stand. And so the goal of this is essentially to pick one type and pray that we are able to open them um, or open enough and then use the customers here to kind of gain those coins. And so my goal is essentially right now, well, my strategy rather is to try to place restaurants down and then eventually get those customers. Uh, and so we look at the customers, we got chicken, tomato, fish, we got uh uh, flowers, grapes, flowers, tomato, uh, grapes, and fish. So I think we have a lot of uh, flowers for the two and three. So the twos and threes, we got, you know, five flowers, five flower stands. Um, but these are the big money makers here. Um, and I do have chicken, and there is chicken here. So I'd say let's focus on getting that chicken for now. Let's make that our stand of choice. Okay, and so what we have here is uh, we have the restaurants face down, and they have one dollar. So the first thing I'm going to do is most likely um, place one of these stands down. And if I am placing a stand down, let's go ahead and place it in the center because I do want that this beer or this pub stand. Or restaurant which will allow me to gain an extra dollar if it's adjacent to one of my stands so let's go and pop that down it is going to cost me a dollar okay and i'm going to take this i'm going to take this restaurant and then i'm going to go ahead and place one of my pieces on it why does it matter well because i'm limited to i think eight of these two three four five six seven. yep eight so i'm limited to eight of those and so you can see right now, just in the center, I have the chicken. And actually, to make it easier to see for you, I'll do it this way. And hopefully that helps. That's a chicken stand that I just opened up. Okay? And so I have no more money. I cannot take the one coin action. It's not allowed in the solo mode. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to start, I'm going to go ahead and place this um, token somewhere. Um, hmm, you know what? I might undo the reason being, yeah, let's go ahead and undo that real quick. I'm just going to place this back. And instead of putting this chicken stand in the middle, I'm going to put it here. Okay, that's still going to cost me a dollar. The reason I did that, actually, you know what? I'm trying to think, guys. Yeah, you know what? Let's go and undo. Instead of doing that, I'm actually just going to place this here. Okay? The reason being is I'm not working towards fish. So I can use this fish to then gain other restaurants and gain a dollar. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to use the fish. I'm going to take this, place it face up, and it's gonna, I'm going to gain one dollar. Um, and then I'm going to take this wine token. But actually, before I do that, I should have taken this. So I'll take the chicken, and I'm going to go ahead and draw from the bag to replace that token. And 
and we have tomato, a tomato smoothie. So the reason I did this and the reason I took the fish uh, restaurant is because right now I'm thinking I'm focusing on fish or grapes and I need money. Uh, right now, the only way to, for me to get money besides customers is by placing down restaurants. Um, and I want to be able to place these things. It just makes sense, right? Um, and to maximize my money making skills, um, the next thing I'm going to do is I think I'm going to place the chicken stand here. Okay. That's going to cost me a dollar because it's the only one in the column and in the row. Now I have two restaurants and let's go ahead and take a look over here. What do I want? Well, here's my game plan. My game plan is to either have four, um, here, you know, grapes pretty, pretty big up there too. Um, yeah, you know what? Let's 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 try to diversify. We'll make it chicken and grapes. Chicken and grapes. So I will take a grape. Okay. And let's go ahead and draw again. Okay, and we have a flower stand. Okay, flower stand. So uh, chicken's not looking like a good option just because I only have two out there. Um, hmm. I like the idea of grape, you know, um, but I also have. Here's the thing, if at, on my next turn I place a grape and I take this plant, uh, this flower stand, at the beginning of my turn I can redraw these. So let, let, let's go do that. Let, maybe, we'll get, maybe we'll stick to the chicken route. So I'll take this and actually have no money, so I, I need to make some money. Um, and I'm going to go ahead and just drop this here. And that's going to give me a dollar. Um... That's the problem is that once you place these face up, they're kind of stuck there. So I'm trying to find a way where I only have one um, on each row. The reason being is that they do take up space and I want to have at least space for four stands. Uh, so then I'll go ahead and place this one here. It's gonna give me another coin. So now I have two and I was going to place this grape somewhere. Uh, I do need to place it somewhere that's going to help me in case I do want to switch it up and go the grape route. Uh, so I'll place it here. Okay, uh, that's going to give me, that's going to cost me one coin. And then I'm going to take the flower, right? So this is still the same turn where I place it and now I take one. Okay. And that's fish. And just to make sure that I'm reading the rules correctly, uh, here it is. So. Here we go, special case. If there are three identical stand tiles, nope, that's not us. At the beginning of your turn, if you have three identical stand tiles in front of you, which I do, uh, I have the three flower tiles, you may draw three new tiles from the bag and then return your three of a kind. So let's go ahead and do that now. Uh, great time to implement or great time to utilize that rule. So we draw three first. Here's hoping we get some chicken, right? Oh, and actually, you know, I keep forgetting to place this here. We'll place it on the side so you can still see. It's great. Okay. One. Oh, well, that's a great. Two. Tomato. Okay. Three. Cool. So we did get another chicken, and then we are going to go ahead and take these three and put them back in the bag. And maybe we should have gone the plant route or the flower shop route, but, you know, we're here. Um... It's not, let's let's just keep trying to do this. Um, go with the chicken route. But I also like the grape route, so we'll, we'll see if that doesn't work. Um, so I do have a dollar, cool. Um, uh, I do want to be able to maximize my potential. Um, so let's go ahead and, uh, you know what? Yeah, let's go ahead and pop this here. No, no, actually, hold on. 
Actually, yes, I wanted to place this here. That's going to give me one. Okay. Um, and I also wanted to place this here. Which, you, you know what? Uh, actually, let's hold off on that. Um, and so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to place this here. So that's going to cost me two. One for itself and one for the other one. Let's go ahead and drop. Sorry. Turn that around and drop this here. Okay. Um, let's go ahead and place this burger stand here. That's going to cost me, that's going to gain me one. And actually, I keep forgetting to do this part, so I've done this. Now let's go ahead and draw one. Um, let's, let's, you know, let's keep going the great route as a secondary option or as a second option. Um, just because that seems to be something that might happen. Chicken, look at that, guys. It's actually looking pretty good. Um, I'm not angry about that. Yeah, actually, that's that's not bad. I'm not mad. But I do need money, so here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to place this here, right? That's going to gain me one. And the reason I did that was because I have grapes. And again, just worst case scenario. You know, in case. So we'll place that there. That's going to cost me one, two, because you always pay the most. So that's two. And I'm going to go and take that chicken. Okay. And again, I forgot to do that. And so I only have three more. Uh, stands to place down or the ability to only place three more stands down so it's not looking so good all right so looks like we got a lot of tomato too give me a second i'm gonna take a little swig of water okay and just let's take a closer look at what we see um so you can see right now, this restaurant is worth one, two. This restaurant is worth one, two, three. And this one is also worth three. One, two, three. Um, I do have a chicken stand here, which I will then place here, or a restaurant rather, which I will place there to give me uh, one coin, because I do want to place this one. I do want to place this chicken stand. Um, Hmm. So I do have two stands here. Um, and I do need one more dollar or one more coin. Um, I can I could place my tomato stand somewhere that doesn't matter. And I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to place it here, which is going to cost me a dollar. Then I'm going to take the fish. The reason being is that I'm hoping that whatever comes out is tomato. So that I can redraw those fish. Look at that, another fish. So that was not a good move. Fine, whatever. Um, I do need another dollar. So I'm going to take this and I'm going to pray that's a dollar. And I'm going to place this one here to gain myself another dollar. And that's two. And then I'm going to place this here. Which is going to cost me two, one, two. And I just realized I'm uh, essentially only one away. I have one more tile. Um, place. So I just took the fish because why not? I'm going to replace it. Oh, look at that with an, another tomato. And there is a clause here or a special case. I'm going to go ahead and zoom in. That says, at the beginning, uh, nope, if there are three identical tiles in the display when you need to take one, uh, you may first replace the, th the display with three new tiles from the bag, uh, which won't matter because we only have uh, the ability to place one more stand. Um, and in order to make the most money, let's just, you know, place these babies, the restaurant, so that's one. And then I will just place the last one here, because 
Nope, actually. Let's just place it here. It's going to give me another coin. Um, and so now what matters is essentially where I can maximize my money. So we know we got chicken here, which is four, but I already screwed up, guys. The reason being is that there's nowhere on here that's going to have, that's going to give me four. Um, it's just, it, it isn't going to happen. And then if we look here, there's no chicken, no chicken. Why, why did I go with chicken? I don't even remember, remember why I went with chicken, but it seems to have been a bad idea. Um, I'm not, I'm not proud. I'm not happy. Um, uh, but I think what I'm going to do is I'm thinking I'm just going to place uh, this stand here. That's one, two. And the reason being is because that will at least let me get rid of some of these grape ones. So I'll take the customer, place them up here. That means me no money because I think I... Well, let's... Hold on. Let's think for a second, right? Let's think. So grape, here's this one is giving me... It's going to give me one, two. One, two. One, two, three. It's just, it's not a lot of money. So let's stick with, let's stick with chicken. Okay. So that's that. Well, at least we got a chicken here. Um, we place that there. That's going to give us one, two. So $2. This stand is going to give us one, two, three. So $3. So it's going to give us $5 total. Okay. And we do have another chicken here. So there are two stands here, so that's why we can only use a two stander. And that's going to give us one. Well, hold on. Actually, I just realized something. I forgot that that was a restaurant, a chicken restaurant. So that's one, two, three, one, two, three. So actually, it should have gained six. Not impressive, but it is what it is. This here is going to give us one, two, three, four, plus one, two, three. Oh, you know what? And I forgot it's times two. So actually, I should take 12. See, guys? Okay, so I'll take the 12, and then this one's going to be uh, a little more, so it's 1, 2, 3, 4, plus 1, 2, 3, uh, so that's 7 times 2, which is 14. I'll just take 1 and give myself a 5, okay? Not bad, but not great. Um, I don't think there's anywhere where I have three, three, three uh, restaurants. It's just two in every row because I, I was cheap. Um, and that's me, you know, that's me where the single ones come in. I should have used it maybe. But, okay. Um, so, I only have uh, a couple types of restaurants. So, we'll take this here uh, and we'll place this grape here because I don't need it. It doesn't bother me. But now we have tomato. Um, I'm not happy with that, guys. Um, okay, let's go ahead and just place this here, and that's going to give us one, this is worth one, two, so it's going to be two dollars, okay, and that's, I don't have any other choice, well, actually, I guess I could have, and not made any money, this is only one, two, yeah, let's go ahead, and, you know what, let's take our chances, um, and let's take, this tomato, or this tomato here, right? I get no money for the chicken stand, but that's fine. Maybe the next one will be a chicken. And cool, so we got some more chicken. And let's just pop this here. Or actually, I think this one, yeah, this one got us more. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six. Wait, 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 wait. One, two, one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, that was six. Why did things go seven? One, two, three, four, five, six. So I, I gotta I gotta return two. One, two, three, two, three, four. Okay, and now let's go ahead and take care of this one. And that's gonna be one. Yeah, that's gonna be twelve. Let's make some change. Three, four. Okay. 
Okay, so let's let's keep let's keep navigating this. Um, this treacherous treacherous path. Uh, let's go and take the grape guy over here. And let's put this here. Doesn't give us anything. And then let's take this and let's put this here. And that's going to give us one, two, three, plus one, two, three, six, so twelve bucks. Uh, well, and we're up to $49. Nowhere near what we needed, um, but we can still make a little bit of money. So we'll just have to start using these one pieces. So that's going to give us one, two, three. So $3. And that's going to give us three, five, Okay, um, and let's just keep using these chicken pieces because why not? That's all I got left here. That's there. That's one, two, three, four. That's one, four. Please. And then I'll take this chicken one over here and just place it here. It's also going to be one, two, three, four, five. Um, okay, hopefully we get another chicken. No, no, no chicken. Um, we can use this on the tomato because it doesn't really matter. Um, and let's see, the game does end if we have four spaces left. One, two, three, four. We have more than four, so we're fine. Um, and I don't have any fit. I do have grape, so yeah, let's go and do that because I don't know how many chicken uh, are left, but like, we, we need them. Um, and this one gives me one, two, three. This gives me one, two, three. This gives me one, two, three. So we'll just do that and give us one, two, three. One, two, three. Um, Okay, that's fine. I don't think there are any more chicken pieces. Yeah. Uh, so there aren't any more chicken pieces. And one, two, three, four, five. Uh, the game's over. And so I made one, two, three, four, five, six. Sixty-three dollars. Not even close. Not even enough to beat the scenario, guys. Which, if we remember, I'm sorry, uh, the scenario was to get 80, 90, or 100. Where is it? Here we go. The specialist. So I got nothing. I got zero fame points. So I'm, I'm going to just start that one over. Um, just because here's the challenge. There's nine challenges. Cool. But, you know, I'm getting better. I started with 30 points, and now, um, yeah. So cool. Thanks for watching, guys. Appreciate it. Have a good one. And we'll talk later.